Rose, you ready to practice your part of Emmeline for our school play of Emmeline? Yep, Pamela. I suppose so. Okay, Rose, let's get started. And the script reads, Emmeline at the early age of 14 gave birth to a beautiful baby boy. And Aunt Ellen arranged for the wealthy young couple to come and pick up the baby. Emmeline was exceedingly sorrowful, as throughout the months as she felt the baby kicking, she had become more and more attached to her growing baby. And so as Emmeline prepares to return home, her and Aunt Ellen are at the station saying their goodbyes. Well now Emmeline the coach bus will be here soon to pick you up and you made sure you got all your belongings, right? Yes, and Ellen, I got everything. Now Emmeline remember don't speak a word about what all has happened to you here, okay? It will be better for you if you don't, you know. Yes, auntie, I understand. I must keep it all a secret. Now you just let them think that you fell ill and had to quit working at the mill and that you stayed with me to recuperate, okay Emmeline? Yes, auntie Ellen, I understand. And you'll need to try your best to put this whole unfortunate ordeal behind you, as much as you possibly can so you can get on with your life. Yes, I know, Auntie Ellen. I'll try to. And then the script reads, Emmeline thinks to herself, She just doesn't understand that I'll never be able to forget about my baby. I might be able to forget Mr. Johnson, but I'll never forget my baby. Oh, Emmeline, the coach bus is drawing near so anyways. Goodbye dear sweet niece, I really enjoyed your stay with me. Now you'll be sure to take good care of yourself, okay? And you bid hello to all your family for me now, okay? Okay, Auntie Ellen, I sure will and thank you for your help. I sure enjoyed all the time we got to spend together. I shall miss you very much. I will write you. Please do, Emmeline. I shall miss you too. Goodbye, dear. Goodbye, Auntie Ellen. I love you. Goodbye. I love you too, dear. Goodbye. And then the script reads, and Ellen sadly watches as the bus pulls away and travels down the road until it's out of sight. Stay tuned for our next episode of the story of Emmeline, and do please subscribe.